Hi. We're back. Carrie Spellman. Wow. Look at this guy. Already has 150 kills. Because he found some weapons and just unleashed hell upon them. Okay. Let's remove these bandages. Put on some new ones. There we go. Alright, so. If you remember correctly, our, uh, our goal was to get the hell out of Dodge. We've, uh... Let's recenter on myself here. We tried exploring a number of places to try to find a propane torch. We, uh... Went up here. Nothing. We went up here. Nothing. And then we decided, well, let's take a look at some of the, uh... You know... Sheds and garages around here and well we found nothing been a whole lot of nothing for us so our next goal is we need to get to probably here where there's some warehouses and stuff that we can possibly find a propane torch in we're gonna go up there after we make a stop by the house to drop off our stuff and remember our friend here carrie carrie spellman he knew our previous survivor, Brandon, and, uh, well, Carrie's a bit of a psychic. He was able to, you know, know that Carrie was planning some stuff and that, uh, his previous friend who also died was also planning some other stuff and yada, 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 as you said, right? So we're going to slip out through here. And it was unfortunate that our previous guy died, but... Sometimes that's just what happens. Right? Sometimes you can't help but have to bludgeon a goddamn zombie's face in a couple of times. Alright, we're gonna run to our car. <laughs> it should be around here, right? Right? I forget exactly where I parked it, actually. Right there, okay. So if we were to go just directly to the west, uh, fuck, there's so many zombies right there. We're gonna have to like get in the car and start it immediately. Come on, 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 come on. There we go. All right, we're not gonna be able to go that way. We're gonna have to turn and go a couple of different directions here. Shit. I think I can slip past that. Oh, there's a fucking thing there, too. Damn, bro. Well, shit. Eh. He threw. You know what? I'm gonna hop out for a second here. Try to detach the trailer. Okay. Can we do it now? Alright, it's detached. The problem is going to be getting it uh, attached to the car now. Pop of anything on him? Hmm, yeah, he did. Another cop, huh? A cop's in this neighborhood. Anything on you, sir? Like ammo, maybe? No? Okay. Ah, let's see. Catch trailer to dash with the blah blah. So let's see if maybe I can use the car to kind of get at a weird angle here. If I can maybe do it like this, and if I can get it just, like, here, maybe. 
Alright, let's see if we can get it now. If I go here... That's trailer to Dash Elite. I think that's what I want to do. Oh! It's a little janky, but let's see how it goes. Can I go forward? I can! Let's go! We just gotta... Hopefully... Shit, we're gonna have to get out. Can't do that. Alright, let's jump over here, and we can kill these zombies real quick-like. Why are y'all going over here? What, the gate's open? I thought it was closed. Damn, if that one zombie wouldn't have come over here, I would have been perfect. I'm gonna go over here real quick, like. These gates open too? What the fuck? They can just walk through these gates? That's just a little bit messed up, ain't it? Oh, here we go. We got some that I can... Never mind. I just can't fucking bash your head in for... Whatever reason, my guy just doesn't want to do that. I'm gonna have to kill these zombies, unhook the trailer, move the car a little bit, and hook it up again. Let's kill that one. I'm gonna need to take some, uh, some different kinds of pills here real quick. Let's uh, do that. Pain pills, pain pills. There we go. Takes pills. Yep. Where are all these zombies coming from? Is it just because they hear the throttling of my fucking vehicle? Jesus Christ. There ain't no way, man. There ain't no way. Okay. What if I run over to this house and I like, kind of lure them over here? Will they try to go all the way around, or will they come over? Oh my fucking god, this is bad. Uh, time to go. Nope, get out of the bush. Ooh, fuck. Run. Go over. I can lie. I give me like one hit in before I like fuck up. God, I'm getting fucking tired and sleepy apparently. I don't know how I'm getting sleepy already. This sucks. There's still so many. If I had a shotgun still. I don't have any shotgun ammo on me, do I? Now, if I did, I'd go back and get that shotgun and come back over here and wail on them a little bit. I think if we can lure them far enough away from the car, we might be able to lose them in one of the houses. Get some sleep and rest. And then we can uh, keep going. Let's try to bash some of these close ones here. Okay, am I doing any fucking damage? Come on! Oh, cool, we have some more zombies over here. As long as I can get them far enough away from the car. Oh, they have a little greenhouse here. That's a fancy little thing. All right, we're going over here. Here they come. We're just gonna walk nice and slowly. We're gonna jump over this fence here once they're done. Come on. Come on. All right, let's go over now so we don't uh, put ourselves up here. We're going to go over that fence, over this fence. We're going to see if we can get into this. Come on. Smashing it, we go. Go ahead and sleep. Not even gonna worry about looting anything. We just need to sleep right now, so let's do that. Okay. 
And uh, with that done, I'm gonna go ahead and remove these bandages, and uh, we're gonna rebandage them. Just so we're keeping that fresh. You guys got anything in here? Like maybe a shotgun or some shells? That would be really freaking nice. What else we got in here? Nothing. Okay. Let me do some uh, adjustments to my inventory here quick. Okay. Let's head downstairs, grab something to eat. Hopefully they have something just quick. I don't have to like open up cans or anything. Okay, we're opening up cans. Uh, spaghetti. Bolognese, what the fuck is this called? Eat all this. Okay. I'm gonna drop the tin can. Alright, let's go ahead. I'm gonna jump over this fence. We're gonna head down here. Over this fence. And we're gonna go one more house down, I believe. I hope our car isn't out of gas, but if it is, we might be able to find a gas can, if anything, I don't know. These little metal gates kind of suck. Oh, 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 those stopped me, but the other ones didn't stop the zombies, huh? We got one zombie over there. Maybe I try to kill that one, since it's by itself. There's two now. Three, four... Couple. Yep. them down. Let's keep heading on in. I'm just gonna ignore that lady there. Did I... Where did I go? I went down this way, right? Why am I exhausted already? Oh, there's my car. Of course, it still has zombies around it because they are uh, attracted by the noise the engine's making. The car must be loud as fuck. Yes, let's go. Damn. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Nice. All those zombies dead. Perfect. That's not where I left the car. Did the zombies, like, push it or something? Or did it, like, glitch out because it's, like, hooked up weird? Come on, you jerks. Stop coming at me. Okay. Um, V, please detach the trailer. Okay, trailer's detached. I didn't move. I think there was a zombie back. No, there's not. Okay. Thought I saw one. Apparently I was just mistaken, which is not surprising. Check her back. Back is clear. Get in our vehicle. Don't tell me I'm fucking caught on a trailer.
Okay, there we go. We're off. Perfect. Now if I back it up properly, so we're not, like, at a weird angle. I think we can just come over here. We can attach the trailer. All this for a fucking trailer, y'all. Okay. Oh my god, we're away. Holy crap. Okay, so we're not gonna go down that road, because that's where we ditched the zombies at. We're gonna go up one more road, and we'll turn left. My god. That was, uh... That was intense. We went from 159 to uh, almost 20 more zombie kills just from dealing with that. I hate this car. It, it's so loud. Uh-oh, don't tell me this is just a fucking square. Uh, not square, a loop. I have no idea where I'm at right now. Go down this way. If I just, like, tap W a little bit, like this. I think I'm quieter to the zombies, or does that, like, not count? Where am I at? Here? We're gonna go left. And we're gonna go right on the next big road. For a big boy. I don't know if it's a big boy. Yeah. Well, so far, Carrie has, uh, done a lot in a short time as our player character. He went from... I mean, just look at the stats, dude. He's leveled up short blunt, reloading and aiming. Meow, meow. Oh. Sorry, guys. Shouldn't be standing in the fucking middle of the road. Alright, just a little bit more and we're home. Once we're home, we can unload our stuff, rest up, learn from our book, and pass on our knowledge of reloading and stuff. I'm just gonna go right here, turn it off, hop on out. And we're uh, we're just gonna skedaddle over to one of our ropes that go up. Use the rope. Use the rope. Use the rope. Okay, how about this one then? I don't understand the rope sometimes. Like, sometimes it works if I just press E next to it. Other times, it's like, no, you're gonna have to do all this weird finagling stuff. And uh, it's just kind of annoying. Right, anyway, home sweet home. Let's get the shit out of our backpack. And rest up a little bit. Our wounds look okay so far. Ah, home sweet home. What did we have in our inventory? Mostly just medical, ammo, and that kind of stuff. Okay. So we can take this stuff. We can go ahead and throw it in here. I'm going to keep the tweezers just in case we ever need them to, you know, do stuff. Um, keep that stuff on me. Then... I don't think I can store any more ammunition in here, right? A little bit. Not a lot. So let's go over here to our uh, next one. Where we have this stuff we can store in here. Along with these deagle mags. And then over in this box we can store our screwdriver. Not our screwdriver, our nails. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then... Hmm, we can go ahead and store our... Oops, hold on. And, uh, make sure we're on the right box. We can store our pistol and stuff in here. That's going to weigh us down as well. All right, excellent. We got uh, all the stuff that was weighing us down out of our inventory. And while we're here, well, I guess before we do any of that, let's move over to here and read from our bound journal. Read. We'll be able to see our stats rising in, in real time here, just going up, up, up.
Wow, I really did like nothing else. <laughs> it's a shame it doesn't increase uh, fitness and strength. But I guess that stuff would be technically hard to learn from a journal, right? Do we have like one or two more levels of carpentry? <laughs> Oh my god, even more? Okay, there we go, finally. It just took us a minute. Alright, let's go ahead and transcribe everything, which is going to be a lot of our extra materials. Or extra stuff like aiming and reloading. Yeah, man. Almost there. There we go. Alright, so now we can pass the bound journal back into here. And unfortunately, we will have to reread some of the skill books that we had read previously, but that's going to be no big deal. Alright. Let's head in here and have ourselves uh, food. Ah. Perfect. Have ourselves some chips. Good stuff. All right. More boards and all that nonsense. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's smoke. Okay. Let's check our wounds. That one's good. And this one is good, too. Perfect. All right. We are ready for the day. I'm going to put the... Uh, Adhesive bandage over here. Okay. Beta blockers, painkillers. We're gonna keep those because those come in handy as we do things. Um, we have tweezers in the backpack, right? Yep. That's pretty much everything we need right now. All right. Um. Before we set out, I think what we want to do is we're just going to read First Aid Volume 2. Because if we, uh, well, first of all, it's it's about to be nighttime, and I don't want to head out during night again. But the other thing is, uh, if we do end up, like, healing ourselves or something while we're out and about, I want to be able to get experience for it, right? So I might as well do that. And then once this is done, we'll uh, store it away. I won't necessarily read anything else until we're actually doing that thing. So like farming, for example, I'm not going to read farming until we actually start farming, which is going to be a little ways away, I think. I think we have to find some sacks in order to transport dirt. And then I want to take that dirt and put it on the roof here where my water collectors are. Because that way I will have... What was up there? All right. Easy peasy, that's done. So one thing I want to take a look at. Um, pause. Uh, skill journal. This doesn't necessarily matter, but what what are passive skills? XP journal used when read. No thanks. You know, maybe I increase the uh, the speed at which these can be written and read at. So I'm just gonna go five and because anytime we use them, we're in the safety of our own home, right? So there's no point in really. You know, not having it go by a little bit faster. Okay. Cover passive skills. Which would be fitness and strength. Yeah, it doesn't make sense for those, so I'm just going to leave those alone. Um, all right, apply changes. There we go. Cool. So, without further ado, let's hit that button. We're going to get up. We're going to sleep. Throughout the night here, which is not necessarily night, it's more uh, morning now. Wake up. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna eat one more time. Then we're gonna leave and try to find the next thing here. I'm just gonna grab one for the road. I'm gonna, well, before we smoke a cigarette, let's go ahead and fill 
our uh, water bottles up, take a drink, and then we'll smoke one of our cigarettes. Here we go. All right, let's head down. Oh my god, I do this every time. Well, not every time, but I keep doing it. Hold on. How is my metal bar? It is not in good condition. Good thing I checked that. That would have been bad. We would have went out with this and then, like, just gotten wrecked because we had that there. Okay, let's see. Metal bar, metal bar, metal bar. Grab one. Here we go. All right, we have another metal bar. We're ready to go. I probably shouldn't be super... Oh my god, I did it again, guys! We literally just did this. Anyway, we also have to search that trailer that's down there to see if there's anything in it. But, uh... Yeah. Anyways, I wanted the trailer for when we're, uh... Actually gonna start fortifying more. That way we can just go down to the forest down there with the van attached to it. And then we can... You know, take the, uh wood that we harvest from trees down at the forest and just easily put them into I was gonna just jump off and not use the rope for a second there anyway we can just use the, the trailer and the logs put them into the van and the trailer and I guess we got oh oh hey I thought they were on the other door like last time I thought they were on this door again. Not over here. All right. Now oh, it's a beautiful sunny day out. We got a couple of the straggler zombies over there, but that's fine. What's in here? Nothing. Perfect. All right. What was in this trunk, by the way? On oh, empty gas can. Much. Okay. All right. So let's get our route down before we get started. So we're gonna go pretty much over until we have to turn. Then we're gonna turn. And go one, two, three. All right. Three roads. So. Luckily, with the gas can, if we do get into a pickle, we can just fuel up uh, with other cars around us. So, shouldn't be too much of an issue. Do you suppose this thing doesn't have a muffler on it? That's why it's so loud. Or like, what's the dealio with it? Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a flipped over car over there. Far so good. It should also be a little less dense with zombies in the uh, port area. At least I think. I don't know, I'd hope so. I don't know why there would be more zombies over there. Then over in like the retail and residential areas. All right. So let's do as Carrie. Uh, let's do with Carrie what we couldn't do as Brendan. And we shall find a propane torch today. Oh, but we got a police roadblock there. Good thing we're not going that way. So we need three roads. So here's the first road past one. There's two. Then we'll be turning down the third one if I remember correctly. We're just gonna cut across here because I don't wanna kill the zombies. All right, so it was a little bit further down here. We can start seeing some of the. Uh, industrial buildings on our right here. Right, let's open up our map real quick. Yeah, so we're about to turn down this road. I'm not sure if there's only like a specific entrance or what. So we 
one entrance back there that we passed, so maybe I have to go into that one. Maybe I can turn down here, I don't know. Gas is getting fairly low, however. Let's just see where this road takes us. Bop that guy there real quick. You know what, I think we'll stop here for right now. Kind of gather up the zombies. Hey y'all. Hi, how's it going? There's a gas station here right now. That's cool. Hey losers, come on. And that lady looks like she's almost skin and bones. Or is this just their, like, refinement plant, maybe? It's going to be fairly hard to kill all these guys, I think. There's a little tool shed here that we might be able to get some stuff from. Unfortunately, I don't see a good uh, fence area where we can bop these zombies at. And me going back up this way is just going to get them all clustered together further. It'd be great if we had a shotgun, but we do not, unfortunately. Let's go ahead and pop some beta blockers. We're getting a little bit scared. This could be a nice little warehouse. I don't know for sure, but we'll test it out. Go ahead and lure him a little bit. You can see, I think, uh, Terrified is trying to come back with a beta block here stopping it. There it goes. How about we jump the fence here? I can take out these two zombies when they're kind of back turned to me. Those little zombies will go find their own way in. And you got a key on you? High visibility jacket. Nope, no key. Door open, this door does not open. So those zombies are heading up there now, thanks to that. Those zombies are heading down. Are there any windows on this side? There's not. Okay. Fine. Is that the only entrance to this little fenced-in area? If so, that works in our favor. I'm gonna get a little bit closer to this fence here, though, I think. Am I gaining any experience from this right now? Doesn't look like it. 224, 224. What if I go up a little bit closer over here? 5. I think that group would give me some nice experience if I walk around here. Until they find me, that is. Okay. Gate is blocked? How is it blocked? There's nothing in front of it. Okay, well, what if I just jump this then? Can I open it this way? No. Okay. Well, I hear zombies pounding away at stuff. Oh shit, those guys are here. I'm just gonna wait here for a moment. Oh! Never mind, I'm not. <laughs> Please be open. No. No. Great. I need a propane torch. Of course, I need a propane torch to disassemble that. Why wouldn't I? Okay, where was that group of zombies down there? I might be able to get into this shed without alerting anyone. I'm just gonna sha sha sha. More zombies down there too. This could be risky. Fucking took you long enough, my guy. God damn. Alright, I'm gonna sha sha past these guys. But I can turn and fight them a little bit further away from the other hordes. I don't want to... No. Draw them over. I 
they don't have anything on them. All right, where are the enemies at? They're down there. Probably over there where I can't see. Unless that whole horde, like, moved further away. It did. Okay, cool. So if I just slip in here now... Excellent. Come on, propane torch. Oh my god, first try. Holy cow, y'all. That's how it goes. I'm gonna take some stuff here while I'm at it. This propane tank will grab. Why not? Be a little overweight from it, but that's okay. Let me grab another garbage bag as well. Now let's go ahead and eat our uh, potato chips. All right. Now that we're no longer overweight here, let's climb through this. We're just gonna sneak away from everyone. Go to our car, drop off the stuff we got. And we can keep searching. No point in stopping right now, right? Especially when there's that warehouse up here we haven't had a chance to take a look at. The one nice thing about having a crowbar was that we didn't have to... Uh... What? What should I even press there to do that? Whatever. Anyway. I want the tweezers still. Um, put that stuff in the trunk. Not the trunk. The uh, thing here. Whatever. Alright. Alright. I do see a window back here. Okay, that doesn't open. That doesn't open. Let's head around back. Open this window. Doesn't seem like that wants to open. Let me just search the back side here. Hey, buddy. I need you to die. Oh, you got anything on you? Like a key? No. All right, let's try these doors over here. Not doors, windows. Me in. Nope. How about this one? It opened. Climb through it. Exerted myself. I'd like to find another propane torch as well, um, if possible. If not, I'll just take some supplies. It's always nice to have extra supplies, you know. Garden thing. Planks. I'll take planks. I can always use planks. Nothing here. Over here we got that toggled off. Um, I'll take those. I don't remember if I have a lug wrench or not, but I'll take that. And then let's read this map. Not the area I need once again. Shame. I'll grab this gas can though. Always room for more gas cans. Let's see. More metal pipes. I'll take that. Uh, more nails. Excellent. Saw, rake, garden stuff, fire pump. Don't care about any of that. Woohoo, another propane torch. Hell yeah. I said, hell yeah. All right, and then over here, we have just some scrap electronics and stuff we can use with it. Nice picture. Nah, I'm not going to disassemble that. I don't have my electronic skill to do anything. All right, let's hide this inventory real quick. Okay, we're clear to go out. Backpack. Everything in it, except for the tweezers. Into there. Okay, perfect. We are good. How's my metal bar doing right now? It's still holding on. Perfect. All right, so let's open up the map. So right now we are up here. Okay. We couldn't get in any, any, either of these two buildings, which kind of sucks. See if we can get into this. I would be able to do that. Okay. So at this point, we could go home. 
that's a possibility of what we could do right now. Um, I'm going to take this and put it in my secondary, though. And it sucks that just carrying that puts me overweight. Oh, never mind, it didn't. It did until I put it in my hand. But we do need to get a little more gas for our vehicle, so... I believe there was one down here. We can check that. Hopefully get a little bit of gas out of it. Anything on this skeleton? Nah. It's been weathered to hell already. Oof, this is gonna be... rough. This old guy's coming for me. Let's kill him first. Before we do anything else. Hey, bud. Oh, we got a couple more, huh? Okay. Got him. And they're dead. Military boots. Another Louisville map. We clear. Let's look at this map. Was that the one I needed? I don't know. Can't tell. Another one. Okay, come on. I like when they come in one at a time. Very, uh, good for me. Okay. Check our map. Did that fill it in? It did! We have the whole of Louisville now! Nice! Okay. Well, we got a straggler from the horde over there. Will he notice us? He will? Okay. We'll just peel him off. Let's get him over near the other bodies. So, we know this is a kill area where the other ones won't hear us at. So that's good. Perfect. I'm gonna smoke a Siggy real quick. We're getting a little stressed. It doesn't have any negative effects on us yet, but... It doesn't mean it won't in the future. Let's try and get behind the car. I could probably kill all of these guys. But I want to be careful. I think maybe they saw me. Let's let's skedaddle. See if I can just lure maybe those three up. They definitely saw me. Come on, zombies, I'm up here. If we can just take a couple at a time. We'll be able to uh really easily deal with this, so. There we go. Got them. Nice, all right. Anything fancy on them? More cigarettes. Okay. A little bit closer now. I think there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven left in that horde. Oh, that one saw me. That's okay. Oh, a couple more. There we go. I think if we get these three out, I can then take the last four in fairly good confidence. That one. Especially if I do shit like this. Alright, excellent. Annotated map, huh? For where? Rosewood, do not care. We won't be going there. I'd like some annotated maps for uh, Louisville, you know? Okay. Cool. I just stood up and they saw me, so that's perfect. And I guess that one just is going to be left out for now. All right, let's kill him. Oops. There we go. All the zombies have been dealt with. Hell yes. Perfect. Well, if we ever need like military boots or working boots, like sturdy boots, 
We can come over here and watch this vehicle not have gas. It does. Perfect. All right. How much gas was that? Enough. Perfect. All right. We can then go ahead and just slink back away to our... Hey, you want to go away, green? Like, stuff. Notify me that. It, it just weirds me out when I see it. Okay. Perfect. Remember when we had, like, four or, like, five in, uh, like, sneaking and stuff like that? Good times. All right. Uh, back. There we go. All right. And we want to add gasoline. There we go. All right, I'm going to add this gas can back to the back of this boy. There we go. Okay. I wonder if there's any gas pumps up here that we could use, right? Because if they make gas here, Maybe they also have pumps. If they have pumps, then we could use those to refuel when we go on excursions up here, right? That's a hoard. These aren't fuel pumps, are they? I mean, they don't even have a... Even if they were gas pumps, which it doesn't look like they are. Yeah, we don't have a generator or a way to power them right now to uh, even use them, so it doesn't matter. Oop. Excuse me, moi. Let's real quick open up the map. So we are here, so we just wait, yeah, go all the way down, essentially. I believe that it's going to be easy to know our, our turn because the other way was a Ooh. We basically go down here until we can turn to the, the right. And then after that, we know our turn because it's blockaded by police. So it'll be uh, quite simple. Is that kind of some sombrero on him? Couldn't see. Let's just get back home with the propane torch. We can start cutting up fridges and stuff in order to allow our generator to run properly. Now we can actually have light in our house. I right, hear the turn. Ugh, ugh. Thank God that uh, stop sign wasn't very hard or else we would have uh, just got screwed. What the hell is that? Did they just like destroy part of my window or something? Or just like walking past them? I mean, unfortunately, at this point, the uh, any fresh produce that we were would be able to get uh, is basically just going to be worthless. Uh, we would have to farm for it because anything that would be in fridges or anything like that, the power is gone and it's all rotten. So it doesn't matter. Probably getting close to my apartment, right? I'll know because there's the black van and the two overturned cars. So right, there weren't any other like roads. Right? Yeah, we're we're almost there. I, I could have just not checked for another, like, 10 seconds, and we would have been there. So we're going to go up here, over here. We're going to stop, get out, run. 
Wait, did I? Yep, apparently I unequipped my metal bar. I do want to get the propane torch. Wait, do I have it in my inventory still? Do I have one? No, I put them all away. Shit. Oh, that broke. Let's equip the next one. Can I repair that? Doesn't look like it. Drop it on the ground. Okay, we can come into our uh, place here. We'll take some beta blockers, take pills. We don't need no painkillers. All right. Let's take them down. second. Put some distance between us. Oh shit. Yep. That was my mistake. We got way too overconfident. Uh. Well, new character then. No, I might edit the stuff we have here. Um, wakefulness, I feel like it's kind of ruining us. So I'm going to remove... Let's see. Smoker is such an easy, like, thing to deal with. Ah, what else we got? I would like to get rid of slow reader just because it, it takes time to read books and it kind of pisses me off, right? Um, weak stomach's fine, short sighted is fine. Um, prone to illness is fine because we can't turn into a zombie. Um, yeah. If I wanted to remove slow reader, I could just remove wakefulness. I don't know, at the same time. You know what? We'll, we'll keep it. All right. Randomized. Ethan Langley is our next character. Where is he spawn? Probably far, far away. God forbid he spawn in a apartment complex just on the other side of this, right? Okay. Take a look. Ethan Langley. You are. God, you're so far away. Other side of the park, man. Okay, well, not much we can do about that. Let's go ahead and just take a look and see what we have uh, that we could use as a weapon. Um, we have a kitchen knife. Uh, we do have a flashlight that I can put up here. Okay. Uh, plenty of canned stuff, but I don't really care about any of that. Any water bottles? No. I could take this tumbler and apparently not fill it with water, I guess. I thought I could fill those with water. Hmm. Got some cigarettes. I'll grab those for right now. Let's grab the chips. Uh, empty bottle. There we go. Front door. Fill. Bottle. I'm just gonna throw the tumbler down now. I don't need that. All right. Excellent. Search the rest of the house before we leave. Looks like it's a fairly simple two-story. What do we got in here? Other gloves. Hell yeah, brother. I just got a sewing kit. I'll take that. Why not? And then, up on this floor, we have padded pants, denim jeans, and a whole lot of nothing else. All right. Okay. 
guess we'll just head in that direction then. Where would I turn the light off? I just hit F. Okay, perfect. This is a very nice uh, thing here. Grab some food. Probably gonna need it while we. Yeah, those aren't gonna help me at all. Put this in the back here on the floor. Plastic bag, annotated map. Wait, have we have we been here? We had to have been here if I've. If this stuff's just on the ground. I think at one point one of our past lives has been here. Hmm. Yeah, the doors are open and stuff too. Also helps that the uh, back is cleared. The sacks of food. Can I open the sacks of potatoes? I don't want the uh, the food. I do want the sacks though. You see, Ethan fences himself as some sort of farmer is what we'll go with this time. And as a farmer, he knows that good soil is something you need to grow crops. So he is going to grab some of this, uh, some of the sacks that he can in the future, use them to ferry uh, dirt up and stuff, you know. Right, up to uh, wherever he decides to go. Because he knows that his uh, his friends, they were all aware of this, this one friend who was going to go take over the hospital. So he, they're probably around there already because it's, it's been almost a month, maybe, since uh, they've all had the zombie apocalypse hit. And so he knows that if he continues towards there, he should see some sign of his friend, if not multiple friends. So with what little he has, him being a, a somewhat amateur farmer, and uh, relatively decent at athletics, is going to... Well, I say he's relatively decent, but he's the same as everyone else because he hasn't trained or anything, but... He's going to go through the woods, hither and thither, and attempt to find his friends. That's what friends do. Honestly, if they were real friends, they would all be at a start and be like, yo, let's help out. Instead of trickling one at a time to die. But you know what? That's neither here nor there. Well, our friend Carrie did not last very long, but that's all right. We have Ethan here will try his luck next. Right, we're in a clearing. Let's open up our map real quick. We just need to head... Yeah, just... Let's get out of the forest first. Uh, I was going to say it'll be easier, but probably not, if, you're, if we're being honest. It's going to be uh, possibly harder, since we're going to have to have a lot more zombies to deal with. We could find more loot. Did my flashlight just burn out? Yep. Okay, well, we can just drop it then. Wasn't expecting it to go out that quick. Perhaps we can find a uh, another survivor home. Oh, kind of like this one, I guess. Of course, I can't unbarricade them. We don't have the tools to do so. I know the garage door is just like open, but now it's not. All right. Attach. Belt left. Um, so we just have a hammer, which I think that's fine. Uh, that has no battery left in it. 
Let's take some duct tape. Why not? Anything else down here? I can't see shit. I'm gonna sit on the ground. We're just gonna wait. A little longer. There we go. I think we got some nice daylight out here now. Relatively speaking, anyway. Of course, we don't really have a way to tell time. Okay, what if I just fast forward time here? I guess I can't when I'm this close to them, huh? I'm gonna have to wait for them to tear down that damn door. I'm gonna have a granola bar while we're waiting. Why do my jeans already have a hole in them? Come on, tear down your door faster. Oh, now we can speed shit up. Oh, oh I shouldn't have done that right then. My back turned. That was bad. Finish off this old guy. I can finish off this lady. We got a nice digital watch now. So we can tell what time it is and stuff. Wait, what the fuck do I have on? Do I just have. S Apparently, these shoes are better than mine, but whatever. Anyway, let's get in this house. Ah, yes, here we go. Metal bar, equip. Machete, take. Um, let's grab the... That. Let's grab the baseball bat. Spiked baseball bat. All right, excellent. Oh, hey guys. Hey now. No bite. I'll just kill them while their uh, backs turn. Hey, stop that. Oh, hey. Hey there, lady. Didn't see you there. There's another one in there. Jesus Christ, the whole family reunion was up in here. Must have been a group of friends or something that was deciding to live the rest of their life here. We got a jacket. We'll put that on to at least give us a little bit of protection. We are carrying a lot now. Nice if we could find a bag. We have a screwdriver. We can attach that to our belt. Excellent. Now we can start taking stuff apart if we find it. Right, anything in these? No. How about this uh, little... Excuse me. I want to see that. Fine. I don't even care anymore. Uh, decent quality hand torch. In the bathroom. Unfortunate. Um... Let's go ahead and rip up some clothing here. How much does that give me? Seven sheets, huh? Also, a bunch of dirty rags. We're just going to drop all the dirty rags. I don't need them. All right. I was hoping for, like, maybe a shotgun or a gun or, or something from here, but... If I do that, I can access this, huh? Oh, yep, nothing. Okay. Well... Worth a try. All right, so looking at our area now, we are here. We basically have to get up as far as we can go. Maybe we'll try to find some more vehicles. If I can find a vehicle that works, we can try and take it up with us and go from there. Let's kill this guy. Yeah. <laughs> Every zombie we kill now is a zombie we don't kill later. Yeah, 
I do see uh, that burned house right there. Maybe we can find a fire truck nearby it. What over here? Comic books. Okay. Or maybe there'll be a firefighter inside. We can kill and take his stuff. Why is it locked? Magazine. Hmm. Let's just go out the front door. Okay, looks like, uh, yeah, no firefighter or anything there. We might find a car over that way. There's two burned houses right there, huh? Okay, well. What if we go around back here? Maybe there's cars. There's one. Come over here. Sorry, lady. You're gonna die. Again, I guess. Anything that way? Nope. Oh, this is another gas station, huh? Okay. I see you there. Don't think I don't. I ain't no fool. Just come in here and mess with me, huh? Hey, buddy, I'm gonna need you to uh, die. Okay. Open up the map. I'm gonna put down a. Well, I need a pen or a pencil for that, so never mind. Let's check these zombies, see if they have any keys for any vehicles. Are there two zombies here? Or just one? Okay, never mind. Now let's check the ground as we walk around here. Never know if maybe someone dropped their keys in a hurry. Keys, 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 come on. Yes, we got a key. Hell yeah. Oh my god, how did we get that lucky, bros? Let me get a pen real quick. I'm gonna mark this down as a gas station. There we go. All right. Moment of truth. It has gas. Let's get the fuck out of here. This is so good. It's quieter than our last vehicle, too. Oh, love to see it. You know what we haven't found yet? A policia station. Unfortunate. All right, went off the map real quick. So if we just go, yeah, left down here, we can go all the way to our home. Man, it really sucks because we didn't get to transcribe the, the light footed or the you know, like other levels we had gotten while we were out at the uh, area up north. shame. Also, we haven't checked the trunk of this car either. What's in the glove box exactly? A bunch of garbage. Shit, I'm gonna have to kill some people here. Ugh, just one. Nice. Saved it. Also, we might as well, uh... Oh, we don't have any matches. There we go. Matches. Now we can smoke. Don't mind me just smoking my car as I come down here. Also, having extra cars isn't necessarily a bad thing uh, because we can use them to, to murder a bunch of zombies just by running them over. Uh, so if we find a really good car as possible of doing that, just like this. Meow. Fuck, kid. Pretty sure he's still alive, but you know. You know how it goes sometimes. Alright, let's go ahead and park this guy not there. Alright. Open torch. Grab that. Nice. Okay. But for right now, my main goal is just to get inside and uh, get our skill book. Because anything else we do outside here is just going to be wasting our skills when we could be uh, 
doing more. So, I'm also not sure if this guy's going to be tired anytime soon. But for right now, we're just going to put the propane torches up here, uh, along with the rest of our, our loot. Okay. We made it. Hell yes, we made it. All right. So, I don't have any... I do have some melee weapons we can put in here, though. Like baseball bat, we're just going to have to go in this one. All right, and then we have the paint torches that can also go into that one. Um, let's find my... Duct tape can go there, rip sheets can go here, sacks can go in there, sewing kit can go into there, uh, my pen can go in there. Excellent, all right. So, actually before we sit, I'm gonna sit back down. Oh my god, every time, every time, you guys. I do this. I feel like removing those stairs uh, that go up, but if I do that, then I'll be like, oh, well, now I can't just access the roof, which has my water and eventually my crops on it. But, uh, yeah, whatever. Anyway, for now, we're just gonna come down here. Alright, now that we've ran this whole way, we're gonna go ahead and sit on the ground. Wait a little bit. We're gonna wait until 12. There we go. Now our guy's a little bit more rested. You motherfucker. How dare you. Alright. Handled. Okay, and now... Let's go get our stuff back. Oh fuck, I was gonna read the binding, but whatever. Shouldn't matter too much. We died up there? Where did we die? We just gotta find the guy who's like wearing stuff. Yep, there it is. Luckily, all those zombies are gone. I say after I see uh, all the zombies fucking coming towards me. Yeah, they, uh, <laughs> they weren't all gone. Here's what we're gonna do. In defense. And we're gonna lure them over to this side. And then I can just jump the fence after they're all gone. Or like kill any stragglers we have. Man, our previous guy was doing so good. He like He had killed so many zombies. We were getting so close to the point we were no longer gonna get panicked and stuff. No, don't come up to me. Go around. Also, the field still has just a bunch of, like, strewn about weapons in it and stuff. There's, like, a burn mark from there from when we were using Molotovs. It's hilarious. Why aren't you guys coming over here? Come on. Come on. I'll run down here for you. Hey. Hey. Come on. Come around the fence. Come on. In fact, you know what? I'll bop a couple of these guys on the head. Here we go over a little bit better. Let me kill that one. Here we go. Right, time to run. Meow. Okay. Come on, come on. And jump it. Ha ha! Get juked, nerds! You fucking idiots! You fucking really thought, huh?
we run. And jump the fence again. Slowly but surely, we'll get our stuff back. Oh, hey. Just the thing we needed. Chips. We still gotta grab my beta blockers and all that garbage, too. Just gotta be careful not to get exhausted from messing with the zombies. Alright, we can kill this guy here. Hopefully. There we go. Zombies, follow me. All right. I'm trying to be quick about this. Alcohol wipes, bandages, beta blockers, gas mask, wear it. Denim shirt, wear it. Hoodie, wear it. Hood down. Bulletproof vest, wear it. Painkillers, grab. Boots, wear them. Matches, grab. Shells bandolier, wear. Water bottles, grab. Don't need anything else. Um, is this the same place my other guy died too? Hm. Anyway. Later on, nerds. made it. Did they uh, destroy that rope? No. Okay. Cool. Made it out. We're alive. We just can't go back down that way now. So. Uh, funny shit. All right. I'm just going to go ahead and drop these cigarettes there. Along with, oh, well, I guess I'll hold on to these clothes. I can put them in my clothing area up here. All right, folks. Well, we made some progress. We managed to find the propane torches that we needed. Uh, our problem, though, is we lost our friend, Harry, in the process. He had a short life, but you know what? I think, in the end, he, uh, he made progress for us all, so that now Ethan, our new character, is able to take the reins and, and do his thing. So, I don't know where I got those glasses at. Okay. All right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right. Let's grab one of these. And then I think my welding helmet's over here. Yeah, there it is. Grab that. Come on, baby. Can I put these matches into either of these? No. And do I have matches and lighters in these? I do. Okay. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to come to this. I'm going to put my matches in there. All right. No longer exhausted, but... Yeah. All right, I'm going to put my painkillers and that stuff, and the alcohol wipes, the bandages. We're just going to put them into my bag for now, so that way this stuff is out here. Um, I'm going to take one of the water bottles and put them into there but of course mess up because of how quickly you put those away grab one i like to have two water bottles i think that's a fair balance there um let's as a treat eat a snow globe okay well the video has gone on for a while here folks so what we're gonna do before we uh quit is we're gonna go ahead and just read the journal Let's just fast forward time here. We can see our stats increasing perfectly. And again, carpentry is going to take us quite a bit because it's it's just how things are. But I just heard something else explode. Do you think zombies are like attacking propane tanks or something, and that's causing like fires? Or like, what do you what do you think?
one, two, seven. How much carpentry do we have here? 6,900. We still got a lot to read, man. Almost done. There we go, we're done. All right, put that shit away. Incidentally, I think I'm gonna tweak that even further. Uh, let's go to like 25. How about that? Oh wait, it barely takes any time. Just cause I mean, we're, we're perfectly safe doing it. All right, let's eat something. Then a guy can go to bed and we'll wrap things up. So, how about some cereal? It's technically morning. There we go. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Ethan's going to bed. And, uh, well, next time, like I had said, we're going to try and start removing the extra fridges and stoves and stuff that we have that's taken up all of our energy from this generator. And then after that, we can hopefully turn the generator on and we'll have like days of fuel left over. So, till then, bye bye for now.